Hello to you, wherever you happen to be. Our action comes to you today from Villa Park. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Aston Villa against Paris Saint-Germain. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And so the battle commences. Kenza Dali. Kirsty Hansen. Well, the supporters think it's on. Is this the moment? There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So PSG restart the game. Can they come up with the right answer? Marie-Antoinette Catoto. Can they square the game? Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Great effort to keep that one in play. And good pressure high up the pitch. Has a go. And no problems for her. Oh, good play, this. A real opening now. Still a chance. But no, that's the end of the move because offside is the verdict. Gielnik. Well, they have the ball once more. Could cross it in here. Will it be? Oh, magnificent reaction. Well, she thought she might have got away with that, but the referee rightly going back and brandishing the yellow card. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, not the best clearance. And still pressing. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here it is again. The cross is inch perfect, just begging somebody to run onto it. And what a great finish it is. Struck with power and accuracy, certainly no stopping that.
So back underway following the equaliser. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Crossing opportunity. Takes the shot. And fine goalkeeping. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Long way out this. Well, after that attempt, gobbled up by the keeper. Hassan, Hansen, and a timely intervention. Now, who can she pick out? Shown inside. Is she going to score? Determined block. Are they going to forge ahead? Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. Lehman. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Well, credit to her for a brave piece of goalkeeping. Well, she's read that so well, hasn't she? She was so quick off her line. And an astute piece of defending. Are being pressed here. Now can they counter clinically? A really sumptuous ball and running in behind and denied by the keeper. Impressive. Kadijatu Jani. Firing it in and the keeper more than equal to the task. And it could be an opportunity for PSG to take the lead from a corner. And still dangerous. Timely intervention. Straight offside, but only just. Mailing. Hansen. Well, clattered away. Oh, a vital interception. Gives it a go. And there goes the half-time whistle. That will do it for the first half here at Villa Park. So back underway here into the second half. It's a corner. Who's going to get on the end of it? Pumps clear. Well, looking over to the referee, what's she going to do, having handed out the yellow card already? 
substitution it is for PSG Lehmann they've given it away attacking possibilities for PSG and beating her marker could be denied by the bar back in play here counter-attacking very much an option all hands on deck can they forge ahead can they cover up oh that is a majestic goal volleyed home with precision and style superbly done Well, here it is again, and when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that, it's a poor clearance, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. PSG chasing this game. Let's see if they can succeed on that front. Very quick thinking there. Kadija to Gianni. And sloppy in possession from Villa. Throw in here for PSG. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. And quite simply, wide of the target. Corsi. Mayumi Pacheco. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Can they keep it going? Giving it a try. Alicia Lehmann. And space to attack. Opportunity! Oh, she should have done so much better from there. 20 minutes to go. And take it away. Jani. Good technique displayed. And a chance to level it. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, PSG won't come any closer than that. It really did look like being the equaliser. They were so unlucky there. Must score! Oh, keeper dealt with it. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Corner to Paris Saint-Germain. What can they do with it? So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Delivering it. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. This could be the equaliser. And it is the equaliser. Well, now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Well, here it is again. And the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area. Just poor defending all round. So back underway, dead level, 2 2. How can they nudge in front late on here? And there to intervene. Ten minutes left for play.
Attacking possibilities for PSG. Did well to win the ball back. Can they hit on the break? And there she is in with a chance. And wonderful finesse, a bit unfortunate. Well, it's an audacious attempt. She just puts too much on it, and the result is it goes over the crossbar. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Under some pressure. How to play then for a Villa throw in. Well, possibilities in the centre. Grasgeiro. Gianni. Progressive football from Paris Saint-Germain. They know a goal at this late stage might be decisive. And there's the referee's whistle. These two sides cannot be separated. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, this is when you have to hold your nerve. And the keeper denies them from the spot. Oh, she couldn't beat the keeper from the spot. Not a great penalty. And that, alas, went horribly wrong. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Superbly done. How many players would try that? And that's how to take a penalty. Low and into the back of the net. Job done from the spot. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. A goalkeeper's touch, but a goal nonetheless. And you've got to say, that was a wild penalty attempt. And all the pressure falls on her shoulders now. Can she do it? In it goes! That seals it! Well, under pressure, that's a very composed penalty. And over the course of the game, they just about deserved it.